reinforcement must be placed in accordance with the project structural engineer specifications, including the correct reinforcement bar sizing, concrete cover, lap length and spacing of reinforcement bars. Ensure starter bars are set out in the concrete in the correct location to allow the ready wall panel to be installed to achieve the appropriate concrete cover to the edge of wall and bar extension to achieve the correct lap length with the vertical bars in the wall. When installing the ready wall panels, ensure all web holes are aligned horizontally. Damage to inside webs can result in bulges when wall is core filled with concrete. Alignment bars can be used to assist with location and installation of vertical reinforcement bars when two layers of reinforcement is required within the ready wall panels. The alignment bars shall be installed horizontally on both sides of the wall, generally at least one third height of the wall and installed progressively as the wall is built. To locate the alignment bars, vertical bar locator strips should be used and fixed to the panels. Once a sufficient number of panels are installed, at every eighth panel, fix the locator to the ready wall inside web face at the desired locations of the alignment bars in the first panel and then in the eighth panel, 16th panel and so on till the end of wall run. Slide an additional panel into place to allow the alignment bars enough clearance to overhang the locator strip. Slide the alignment bar through the locator. These guide bars are not to be considered as part of the wall structural reinforcement. Once a number of ready wall panels are fixed in place, slide the horizontal reinforcement bars through the panel holes. The shape of the panel cut hole will help hold these bars in the correct position. The vertical reinforcement bars are then lowered into the ready wall panel at the correct spacing and lap with the starter bars at the bottom of the panel. It is important to ensure that the vertical bars are installed on the internal side of the horizontal bars and on the outer side of the alignment bars. Note, a small 20mm bend at the base of the vertical bar can be used to joggle the bar past the horizontal bars. The offset makes it easy when lowering the vertical reinforcement bars into the wall between the alignment bars and the outer horizontal reinforcement bars. It is important that the reinforcement is installed in a uniform manner and the correct spacing is maintained. When the vertical bars have been placed in position, ensure that the reinforcement bars are positively secured into position. This can be done via ties to the top of each vertical bar to the top horizontal reinforcement as required to ensure bars remain in the correct position during the concrete pour. Alternatively, the top of the vertical bars can also be spaced and tied in the correct position by using the LVL timber or similar. Please refer to the Ready Wall Installation Guide for further detailed information on the recommended installation of reinforcement for AFS Ready Wall. See our concrete core filling video which illustrates the correct process and technique for core filling AFS Ready Wall.